Daryl, now that you know you've worked with Coach Jackson now for the second camp, mm -hmm. uh, what, have, what have you noticed about him? What's made the biggest impression on you about him? Um, I would say the way he coaches, uh, he brings the confidence out you, uh, makes sure that you're playing fun, uh, doing whatever you got to do to make plays. Uh, I feel like he's going to be a really good coach for the guys uh, that's younger than me. And, and last year, you guys had a real veteran secondary with, you know, Cam and James and mm -hmm. Jaden and TC and all those guys. Now it's a mix of guys, you know, a lot of them haven't played much or they're younger. Mm -hmm. How does it feel and what do you have to do as like kind of a veteran leader in the, in the secondary? I feel like I have to uh, turn into a coach sometimes, uh, telling them what uh, everything that I know um, from experience on and off the field. I feel like uh, I have to do more um, outside of uh, football. What's your biggest piece of advice to some of those younger guys who are coming along now? Um, just play with confidence, be relaxed. Uh, don't worry about you making mistakes. Um, you're still young, you have a long way to go. Um, and I feel like they're gonna be fine. Damari Brown specifically, how's he been doing? Um, he's really, really going to be really good. Uh, if not a first rounder, um, I feel like he has all the tools, attributes to be uh, all world corner, um, all American. So I feel like uh, he's going to be fine. You've known him since he was mm -hmm. a little one, but way back yeah. in high school days, just how yeah. much growth have you seen from him from your guys' days back at Heritage together? I remember when he was about. 5'11", about 160 pounds, bro. He, he was he was a young one, but uh, he's doing well now. I feel like I'm taking him under my wing, and I feel like he's going to have a breakout season this year. Now, how are you a different player than you were last year? How are you a different player than you were last year? Um, I feel like I'm learning more little things um, that I didn't really see last year. Um, Last year, I feel like I was just out there playing, uh, focused on uh, who, who we had each week. But I feel like more I'm learning the, the game even more. And for you specifically, you know, obviously you had a really good season last year. Mm -hmm. um, maybe you didn't get some of the recognition that you deserved. Is that sort of, is that sort of put a chip on your shoulder now for the season? Man, I wake up with a chip on my shoulder every morning, man. Um, I feel like I should be an All-American. I feel like I should be on these draft boards high, but, you know, things happen, but I feel like Things will change after this year. You know, on the flip side of the field, how do you see uh, the offense improving and who are some of the receivers that mm -hmm. you like uh, taking reps against in practice? Um, I like taking reps against Isaiah Horn. He came a long way from last year. He, look like, he looks like a new dude. Um, Sam Brown, um, I know I've been going against him since West Virginia. That was my first roommate. So I already knew how he's going to come in. Um, and then going to play at nickel with Xavier Strucko. It's, it's new to me, but I feel like he's getting me better. Do you have a role day. on Sam coming here? I mean, did you guys stay in touch since that first year? Yeah, we've been we've been talking the whole since back uh, for the past two, three years. But I didn't even know he was going to come down here. It was crazy. What was your reaction when you found out he was coming? I was excited, man. Uh, he actually, We actually live in the same uh, apartment complex now. So I get to see him whenever I want to. Uh, we just hang out, chill, you know. And you touched on it with a lot of new, there's a lot between the younger guys and transfers coming in. and. In the secondary, just how do you feel the chemistry is starting to come along with you guys about three and a half <laughs> weeks away from things starting up? Um, chemistry is everything's uh, going well. I feel like we're getting tighter um, from Robert Stafford to OJ. Those guys are playing really, really well. Um, getting them some reps with the ones uh, to get them prepared even more. And I feel like they're going to be really good too. We'll do a couple more for Daryl. Mm -hmm. Daryl, I mean, like you mentioned, you know, you originally roomed with Sam in West Virginia. Yeah. He goes to Houston. Mm -hmm. He's here by way of Houston. Mm -hmm. You know, Devontae Brown, you yeah. know, went to UCF, came here, he goes mm -hmm. to FSU. Yeah. You, you, it's like reuniting and, mm -hmm. you know, seeing guys again, gosh, we knew from high school, yeah. with the state of college football these days. So what's that like as someone who's been through the transfer mm -hmm. process and seeing guys you've known come and go mm -hmm. and all this stuff? Just what, what's that like? How do you guys handle that? It's pretty cool. It's like free agency, honestly. Like, you never know who's going to be on your team a uh, year from now. And I feel like once uh, this is all said and done, I go to the NFL, uh, it could happen again uh, only when I get there. I, I, how, much, how much do you balance? Like, I mean, obviously, like, it's cool like, if your friends come and rejoin the team. Yeah, yeah. I mean, how difficult does it make it to just, you know, to stay meshed and stuck with, with your teammates? Uh, I don't think it's difficult at all. Um, I feel like now that they come down here, we can go out, hang out like we used to um, before, like in West Virginia. You know, you mentioned that like you should give more attention to whatever it might be. Mm -hmm. uh, interceptions for you, mm -hmm. is that a focal point? Obviously, the big stat. Mm -hmm. Has that been something you've been focusing on? 
Of course, you know, I really want interceptions, like everyone does, but I feel like last year I didn't get as many chances. Um, hopefully I get some more chances this year to make plays on the ball. Awesome. Thanks.